Hey everyone, and welcome back to another Creepy Tech Talk compilation. Smash that like button for us so this video can be recommended to others, and hit that subscribe so you don't miss out on any of our videos because we do upload at least three times a week. Cut on home security camera. I mean, this is my whole closet right here. It's my kitchen. And here we go with this shit again. I'm just gonna wait and see how long it goes. It's never not. Stop! Okay, that works. Okay, so it seems to be wanting to happen now more in the afternoon. But just to prove that there's nothing there. Jesus Christ. If I heard that knocking in my house, I'd be gone so fast. That guy needs to bring over a priest or something because that's just not right. Guys, I just have to go home and I see this like hole in my wall. And like next door, I have a really creepy neighbor. What the? F oh my god! Oh my. My question is, how long has he been stalking her like this? That baby has had enough of his guff already and it's not even born yet. Terrified by Kamilka's strange behavior, the police are unable to go inside and save her. So, as a final attempt to get her out, they head outside and place a ladder against the side of the room where she hides. This, however, did not go as expected. Kamika, 
Pamięta dziecko cię woła. Pamięta. Wiktoria cię woła. You know something's wrong when you have three police officers who are free to approach the woman. Deep within the heart of Irish folklore lies a tale of a unique creature, the Grogok. Originating from Scotland, the Grogok found its way to the lush landscapes of Northern Ireland. Today it's believed to reside in the hidden corners of caves and dense woodlands, particularly in the Kilsally and Knocklade Mountains. Picture a being half human, half fairy, covered in fur with a distinct reddish complexion often seen in tattered clothing that tells tales of its ancient lineage. But what sets the Grogok apart isn't just its appearance, it's the countless stories of its benevolence. A farmer from the 1950s recounted how a Grogok assisted him with his daily chores, lightening his burden. Another tale speaks of a woman on the brink of drowning, only to be saved by this mysterious creature. As with many legends, there are skeptics. Some argue the Grogok is but a myth, a figment of the imagination. Yet, the numerous accounts from both locals and tourists alike paint a different picture. A picture of a creature deeply woven into the fabric of Irish culture. The Grogok's tales have been whispered through the winds, passed down from generation to generation. From elderly locals sharing their personal encounters around a warm fireplace, to intrigued tourists hoping for a glimpse during their travels. Whether myth or reality, the Grogok holds a special place in Irish folklore, a symbol of the rich tapestry of stories that make Ireland's cultural heritage so enchanting. So the next time you find yourself wandering through the Irish woodlands or exploring a secluded cave, keep an eye out. For you might just stumble upon the friendly spirit of Ireland, the Grogok. Yeah, we seem to have a lot of folklore stories here in Ireland. Never heard about this one though. I'm not sure what that was, but that did look pretty cool. It's got like good footage of a skinwalker, but fact or fake is the question. If you thought that was creepy, the call was dropped because the entire radio station was knocked off the air. Pushing the population into one small area sounds very familiar. Anyone know about the 15 minute cities will know what I'm talking about. The idea that the Democrats and the Biden is hiding people and sucking the blood of children and do No, I'm serious. That's. Now, you may not like me, and that's your right. Biden is so weird. Excuse me, it's just yours. Yes, thank you. When I see videos like this, it cringes me. It's not how the Holy Spirit works. Look at this. Don't ask me where I am. Look, ask me nothing. This is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> 
Mooi ook, je bent mee gek. Dat wil ik ook wel. It's just too bad we only got to see a glimpse of it. Yep, this video is seven years ago. <laughs> the last thing you guys would want to see is this thing in the middle of the road at night time, two o'clock in the morning. Aswang. The Aswang is a scary creature from Filipino stories. It can change its shape and likes to eat people. People in the Philippines talk about it a lot and are scared of it. They say it can turn into an animal and fly at night. Some stories say it can look like a regular person during the day. Aswang is the name for different kinds of bad creatures. They all do different things to scare and hurt people. People think Aswangs live more in the countryside and like to hurt pregnant women, babies, and small kids. The Aswang stories have been told for a long time and change a little bit in different parts of the Philippines. Even though the Aswang is really scary, it's also a part of Filipino stories and movies. It shows up in different ways and represents things that people are worried about. So the Aswang is not just scary, it's also important in Filipino culture. That is just pure creepy. I tell you what, I wouldn't want an Aswang. UFOs were, are, they want us to believe in UFOs. They're preparing us for a fake alien invasion. That's always been the plan. A one world government. The I only way to do out. it is to get us to embrace it. And the only way to embrace it is from an alien attack. Ronald Reagan talked about it many times at the UN, CFR. Too sure what kind of fish that was, but that was like a super fish. <laughs> yeah, that's a real weird conspiracy theory, to be honest. What do you guys think? If I was ever famous, I certainly wouldn't be wearing dresses. Well guys, that's all I have for you today, but if you enjoyed this content, please smash that like button so this video can be recommended to others, and smash that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our videos because we do upload at least three times a week. Thank you guys for hanging with me today. Please stay safe out there, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay healthy.